Ryan Steinekert with sophomore Rachel Wamsley at Rich High School. Rachel, thanks for your time today. Yeah, no problem. So the Skills USA competition was what over the weekend. Tell me about that competition. What is it about? It was well, we went down Thursday, and it was Thursday Friday, and it's basically like a bunch of competitions, like the technical stuff. It's kind of like FFA, but it's more like technical, like Bridgerland. What different aspects or what different categories of competition are there? Uh, there was welding, carpentry, robotics. There was uh, nursing, and a first aid, and some others. What did you compete in? I did the first aid. Who selects and how did they select who gets to go? Well, this year's the first year the school's doing it, so they just asked who wanted to go and just took whoever wanted to go, and there was like 13 of us. So are you involved in some way, like in a, a, some classes that you, you know first aid well, like CNA program or something? I took Carrie Pugmire's first responder classes in her IHS class. How did you do at the competition? I got third, which was a big surprise. Where was it? It was in Salt Lake at the Salt Lake Community College. What did you do to earn that third place finish? You had to take a test on first aid, and what I was told is they're made so you don't pass them, but I ended up with 100% on it, which was pretty amazing. Is there like a hands-on part of the competition as well? Yeah, you take the test, and then they take the top three from the test to do the skills, and then they place you from the skills. So they make a test that you can't pass, and Rachel Walmsley says, mm, I can pass that. Yeah, that was that was pretty surprising. <laughs> Way to go. Yeah. Do you know who else was competing? I mean, is it a statewide thing? Yeah, it was the state competition to where first would go to nationals in Kentucky. So. You said like 13 other Rebels win as well? Yeah. How did they finish? The entrepreneuring group, which was Payson Willis and some of his friends, they got second. So that was pretty good. And yeah, that was all it placed. Is that something that you'd been working toward? I mean, did you know it was coming up and you'd been like freshening up on your first aid skills or anything like that? No, I was just told that I should probably try and do it just to see how it would, how it was. And so I just did it. And yeah. Well, congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Rachel, I know you uh, play basketball. What else do you do at Rich High School? Basketball, now Skills USA, and I'm on the rodeo team. Rodeo gets going again this weekend, right? Yep. Are you headed to Ogden? Yeah. And uh, tell me again your the, what you compete in in rodeo. Uh, breakaway, barrels, and poles, and the ring cow horse. Have you qualified for state yet? I've qualified for the ring cow horse for state. So working on gaining points there and then qualifying in the other events as well? Yep. How many events or how many rodeos do you think you'll go to this spring? Probably just the close ones between, I don't know, three hours tops. Rachel Wamsley, sophomore at Rich High School. Congratulations again on the third place finish at the Skills USA State Competition. Thanks so much for your time and uh, good luck in rodeo this spring. Thank you.